What's up YouTube and welcome back to the Test Dummies Challenge! We jumped right into it. We need 2010 cars. Means um, cars from 2010 or above. Um, at least one we need and later will increase. So yeah, we just start here very, very easy. Not this challenge is not too difficult, definitely. Uh, we got a slalom test, a GeForce test. A twisty circuit and twice we need to be as fast as possible. Little disclaimer in the beginning, like always. Um, I usually skip through the levels um, because they're easy. And I don't want to show you how, how I win by like six, seven hundred points. So I'm like, eh, just go. <coughs> Sorry about that. Just going through it. Oh, yeah, um, it is definitely a Dodge 12 party here again. Pretty easy one. 2010 car. Use my Renault Twizy. That's easy. And the rest uh, shouldn't be too difficult. Bam. 1054. Sweet. Wow. By the way, we got some interesting... Speaking about what's coming for this week. Uh, we got some cool videos, definitely. We got the Winter Sun coming. Um, it's a Winter Sun event. A good one. Very interesting one. We got um, openings. Uh, who's following me on Instagram is raising his hand, please, right now. Huh? I can't see you, but... Uh, I believe a couple of you are doing it and uh, I posted a story asked you a question on Instagram many times I'm asking questions uh, to figure out what you want to see next uh, what pack should I open or something like this if you want to uh, be more involved in that definitely just follow me on Instagram I think most people use Instagram so it's pretty easy there one second let's go now uh, next round you see still one 2010 car we got a rainy day three times be as fast as possible and twice we need uh, yeah, I need more handling, so uh, go with standard tires for the handling part. For the rest, you can stick with performance tires if you want to. Um, yeah, back to the topic of Instagram. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm usually like reaching out, asking you guys, uh, should I open this pack? Should I open that pack? Should I, should I highlight this? Should I highlight that? Many times in stories, because that's easier. To get uh, quick feedback from you guys and yeah i asked you about the rwd package pack package pack and the which one was a convertible pack and i asked you should i open and so many people wrote me open both please open both and i was like okay there we go we're opening both so um the next videos will be about the rwd package pack my gosh why did i say package lately pack and the convertible pack we got the winter sun and we got a really cool video uh the beauty of top drives coming up soon you're gonna enjoy that one trust me you want to see that one that's going to be a really good one um i don't want to tell too much but uh, it involves a very nice car and the beauty of top drives um yeah don't want to tell too much you will see you will see so here we go first time rounds are done test dummies seven and a half grand as you can see my cash is currently always like six figures usually i'm trying i'm really it's my road to 500k trying the best of what i can do by the way here slalom test gforce test slalom test three times handling and twice we need to be as fast as possible so get out your mid-range monsters especially for the 30 to 130 miles power challenge yeah make sure that you get get the fast ones out um yeah, there we go, not too difficult. Then what else, what else? Yeah, we, we're playing different games. Um, I'm trying to get back on that track as well. Not only Top Drives, it's not a Top Drives YouTube channel, but Top Drives is definitely sharing the biggest audience on my channel. Obviously, you're watching it right now. You know I'm like almost like one of the only ones out there doing Top Drives regularly. Um, yeah, some other games. I'm trying different games. I, I want to continue my bad game series because that's kind of fun to see how bad games could be. If you have any suggestions for that, you actually drop some. I will definitely do one of those. It's uh, the police traffic simulator or something. Uh, I just installed it. I haven't tried it, but it's, it looks really bad already. So <laughs> I'm kind of excited trying that one. And then, of course, we, we got Nightingale, we got CSR. We got uh, other. We got Kai's Drift Racing 2. We got Torque Drift. 
We got... What else we got? What else we got? Well, we got like Hill Dash Racing. If we speak about like other Hutch games, all those games like Hill Dash Racing 2, Race Kings and so... Um, they don't put or Hot Wheels Race Off. They don't do anything with those games anymore. So there's not much new content I can bring in there. I, I still keep the game just in case if there will be an update. But for the moment, for the time speaking, there's not much happening there. So and and oh, this was a really bad pack, really bad pack. However, let's see how hopefully the ceramic will be better. GeForce test, fast circuit and three times be fast as possible. Not really an issue for. Uh, cars from 2010 but yeah Hutch games um, what about the new update many people are asking me on Instagram or here as well um, I don't know it's supposedly coming in a few weeks I don't know what's holding them back we know that there will be a lot of new features and you a, a totally revamped a redone uh, um, um, daily daily feature that will be cool I don't know what cars it didn't tease anything regarding cars. They teased something regarding a hill climb twisty circuit, kind of like this, like a Pikes Peak stuff, which is going to be interesting um, to see what cars could um, do it there the best way. But yeah, I don't know. What else? What else? Yeah, new Hutch games. Well, they do the. Um, they do have a uh, Formula 1 license now. They're actually working on a Formula 1 game. I'm definitely excited for that because I haven't really seen a good Formula 1 game on mobile. I mean, there's a Motorsports Manager, but it's like a managing game, not really a, a racing game. So I want to see if, we, if they can actually pull off something really nice. If someone, then definitely Hutch can do that. So, but okay, focus on this one right now because, okay, we lost that one, but that's okay. Should be good with it. Yeah, the mid-range of the NSX is pretty good. And ceramic pack. Let's see. Pack luck or not? What are we getting? Maybe some monster drops. Mazda Cosmo. Chevrolet Aveo. And that's a good one. Mazda X7 Turbo. And oh nice! An ultra rare. Uh, and, uh, the John Cooper works. The countryman. I have one already, so I don't think I will work another one. So perfect. Fuse material for my epics. Can definitely help me a lot. There we go. Now we need four cars from 2010, and one can be anything. So you better get out your new collection. And yeah, by the way, the price, the price car right now is a, uh, for me, it's typical fuse material. That's super rare. The Honda S2000. Not really interested in that one. Nobody, I never saw really dominating somewhere, so. Yeah, not really. No. I got the Nissan, the uh, 370, I think that or 350Z. I got that one maxed out. I'm kind of fine in that direction. So, bam, slalom test doing fine. KTM is still rocking it. Six sixty-three to zero. Mm -hmm. Ooh, look at that. Three eighty ninety. Twisted Series comes with Honda Civic on Test Boy can get a lot of points. Same on GeForce Test. Half my track as well. Let's drop the 4 GT there. Uh. Okay, so. There we have the last round. I will try to farm that one. I was going to. Oh, that's a pretty decent GT1 Roca. Um, I'll try to farm that one. We'll post it on Instagram if we find a farming hand. If you have one, let me know down below in the comment section. Wish you a wonderful day. That was a casual mob by Gamer. I'm out.